Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I would like to share with you swatches of something that I am so excited about sharing with you and it is the Urban Decay Lipstick Palette. It's the Vice Palette and it's the Blackmail um, version. I know there's two. This one is more of a neutral palette, although it has got some reds in there. But the other one, I don't know what the name is. I haven't seen it anywhere available in the UK, but that has a, I believe, a green lipstick in it. And that's how you tell the difference. But yeah, I'm really excited. I absolutely love anything to do with Urban Decay. I think the quality is there. I just love it. So I had to pick this up to see what the actual lipsticks in the palette is like so this is the actual box so it looks like that this is the back shows you all of the shades that you get inside i picked mine up from house of fraser when it was on offer i think it was 26 pounds something like that they have now sold out but it is still available at Selfridges and the price is £31.50. They do say on their website there is th only three available. So if you do want this, you need to obviously uh, go onto the Selfridges website as soon as possible. Now the packaging itself looks like that. It's absolutely gorgeous. It says exactly what it is, which is the Urban Decay Vice. And on the back, it looks like that. And then on the inside, it is very interesting because it has this piece here that covers the lipsticks. So obviously it keeps them from, I, I suppose, drying out or perhaps getting damaged. But these are the actual lipsticks. You've got neutrals in there, you've got burgundies, you've got pinks and you've got reds, absolutely gorgeous. So what I'm going to do today is, as you can see, I've not swatched it myself, so I'm going to swatch all of these shades for you. You do get a lip brush as well with this. So I have not even, not opened this at all. Oh, there we go. So there's your lip brush. And it just, it's retractable, so that's great. Um, I do actually like the brushes that have recently come out with the palettes. I think they are very, very usable and yeah, I really do like them. But obviously with this palette, obviously the, the interest is in the lipsticks themselves to see um i mean i don't particularly like lipstick palettes and if you are a regular viewer to my channel i have spoken about this before because i find that lipsticks in a palette they tend to be more glossy rather than a lipstick the one that i absolutely love and really changed my mind about lipstick palettes was the one from freedom makeup which you can purchase from tan beauty it is only 10 pounds i have the nude palette the quality is there it is just like a lipstick a true lipstick palette so i'm really interested to see how this one for you know 26 pounds or 31 pounds is the regular price actually you know uh, compares to that um, you know the quality so here we go i'm going to go across the top row and i'm going to start with let's have a look sheer shame so it's going to be this one here and it's the dark dark burgundy So I'm just going to, I'm not going to pop my fingers in. I just find that putting fingers in lip palettes doesn't seem that hygienic to me. So I'm going to pop it on a brush and I've got all of my makeup pads here soaked with a makeup remover um, so that I can obviously clean the brush each time. So I'll just swatch that one for you. Now starting off, it does seem fairly sheer actually for a deep color so in the pan that was extremely deep but when you swatch it it's like that so it does seem sheer uh, I mean the name is sheer obviously and it's shame but um, that does seem extra sheer so I'll be very very keen to see what the others swatch like now I put about three swatches on there so that's the sheer shame 
then the next one I'm just going to clear the brush um, is going to be firebird and that is a, a quite a deep color as well so I'm just going to pick that up on the brush and I'll just show you that one too so that is firebird So that one's Firebird, that one swatched a lot better. So obviously sheer does mean sheer in this palette. The next one is Big Bang. So I'm just making sure that that brush is extra clean. So this one is Big Bang and it looks like that there. So I'll just pick that one up. This one does seem to have some sparkle in it. Yeah, that is really pretty. And I hope that the camera can pick that up. So it is quite, it is coming off quite sheer, but there's a lot of sparkle in that one. So that one is Firebird. So again, I'll just clean the brush. And the next one looks very, very nice. And that one is Disobedient. So Disobedient is this one here. So again, I'll just pick that product up on the brush. This one seems more of a true lipstick. I'm really pleased with that. The only one that says uh, the name, you know, um, whether it's sheer comfort matte or, you know, whatever, is the shame, the first one. The rest of them don't actually give me what consistency they are. But this one, which is disobedient, is um, compared to the rest, is more of a true lipstick you know the consistency of a proper lipstick so i'm really pleased about that so that one is disobedient then we come to a red and it's is it as e z so i'll just show you that one in the pan so that's as or e z so i'll just pick that product up Again, that one um, comes across when I dip the brush in as a true lipstick. So that, that is really, really nice. I love the consistency of these. I mean, to be honest, um, you know, that we know that um, that range, the Vice range, does have all sorts of consist consistency. So you've got the sheer, you've got the comfort matte, you've got the matte, you've got the metalized. So there are quite a few. So uh, the next one is called 714, and it looks like that there. Now, there is, of course, a mirror I just wanted to point out the mirror as well because to start with I just thought it was like the outside of the case but it isn't it's a true mirror so I'll just now swatch 714 for you so this one again is coming off like a true lipstick it looks very similar to that one, but this one I think may be more of a matte. So that's the first row for you. So I'll just clean the brush off completely and then we'll start on the second row. So the first one is called, sorry, this red is taking a little bit of That's better. So the first one is called, is it Vanished? And it's that one there. So it's the nude one, nudest one in the palette. So I'll just swatch that one for you.
So there's vanished. So that looks really good. The next one is called, I'll have to look at this one. So that one is called 1993. Now this is the lipstick that everybody wanted when these Vice lipsticks became available and um, I've not been able to I mean I do have a number of the vice lipsticks but I was never able to get the 1993 so I'm really excited to have this in the palette and it's that's that one there so I'll just swatch that one for you and I'm really pleased with the consistency of that one so that's 1993 and I'm sure that that one is a comfort matte I love it. I'm really, really pleased with the consistency of that one. So the next one is Ex-Girlfriend. And that one is that one there. So Ex-Girlfriend. So that's ex-girlfriend there, really good again. The next one is amulet. Now I do actually have this in the lipstick form and it looks like that one there. So I'll just swatch that one for you. So that's Amulet there. That looks really, really pretty. I love that. The next one is Conspiracy. And again, I believe I've got that in the lipstick form as well. And that one looks like that one there. So that one is Conspiracy. Absolutely gorgeous, love that. And then the last one is um, even deeper than the very first one. And it look, well, it looks like that in the pan anyway, and it's called Blackmail. So I'll just show you that one. So that's Blackmail. And that's what that one looks like so although it actually looks very deep and it looked I thought actually when it went on the brush it looked very similar to that one but it's got more of a plum undertone to it so each and every one of these colors I mean they're quite similar but I think they are that one's more of a matte I believe and it's just this one's slightly um, redder uh, so all of these seem very very well different um, not very very different but different I think if you like uh, nude I think you've got something there you know there's something there for everybody and of course you've got that sheer one to start with so there is all different types of you know um, sheer and then you've got a matte one and you've got some comfort mats there and yeah <laughs> I think this is actually very interesting and I can't wait to start using that. So I was a little bit concerned to start with when I swatched that very first one, which was sheer shame. A little bit concerned then because I thought, oh no, it's going to be one of those palettes that you, you know, they're not like a true lipstick. It is just like, you know, um, those lip glosses in a palette. So I'm really, really pleased with this. They are all different types. There are, uh, all different colours and you've also got a really shimmery one in the Firebird there. So I'm really, really excited to try this 
and see how long these lipsticks work because the vice lipsticks that I've got are absolutely incredible I absolutely love them they last for ages and I don't think you can go wrong with the actual vice lipstick so I'm really excited to see how this compares to those so if you are in the market for this lip palette I hope that helped to make your mind up as to whether you will go for that one or not like I say if you do want it obviously you'll need to order as soon as possible or of course wait until the stock comes uh, becomes available again in House of Fraser but it does still say uh, let me just have a look on Selfridges their website that they're that three I believe are available and that's £31.50 uh, so like I say thumbs up uh, if you enjoyed that and um, subscribe if you haven't already watched um, so if you haven't already done so to watch for future videos and tutorials but thank you very much bye